Welcome to Love Connection. Today you'll meet Leslie. She claims that her pet turtle helps her meet men. Yesterday, the audience voted on which of these three men would be best for her. Today, you'll hear who Leslie chose as her date. And you'll meet Suzanne. She's back to tell us about her date with the man the audience chose for her. Today, on Love Connection, you'll hear everything that happened on their dates. Now, here's our host, Chuck Willery. Yeah, thank you, everybody. Oh, thanks, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. It's nice to have you here this way. What a good crowd. Get started by meeting our first guest. She's from Long Island. She says that guys are attracted to her Cupid doll lips. She insists that men don't know enough about women, but she can tell you exactly what she doesn't want in a man. Please welcome Leslie Howard. Hey, Leslie. How are you? Nice to see you again today. Well, what don't you want? I know what you want a guy that smells good, but what, what, what don't you what want? What don't I want? I don't want a man who has children. That's no children. Absolutely. I don't want a man who has gray hair. No gray hair. I know eventually they'll get gray, but uh, I don't get them while they don't. Uh, I don't like, like a man who wears glasses. No glasses. I don't like receding hairlines. And uh, what else don't I like? Um, it's, it's probably, I can go on and on. I was going to say, Jim, you really kind of narrow your field down a lot there, don't you? Yeah, I don't like pox skin either. This, I can go on and on. Pox okay. skin? <laughs> and you, said, uh, you said you had a turtle? How, how, how does this turtle help you meet men? Oh, maniac. Oh. Maniac is the name of the turtle? Yeah, yeah, he's, um, Leslie. He's, no, really. <laughs> I mean, me this turtle here. is something else. He's, uh, he's an ex-champion. I go to turtle races. Turtle is an ex-champion? Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. I'll go, I'll go along with you. Yeah. He's a, he's a great you guy. go to turtle races? Yeah. And that's uh, basically how I meet guys. All from all different walks, actually, of life. Very slow walks, probably. <laughs> you don't know maniac. <laughs> no, I don't. Let's remind everybody what happened yesterday. Now, yesterday, our studio audience saw Leslie's three choices, and they voted for one. I'm going to take a look at all three men and catch you up today. First was Bruce. He thinks that women are attracted to him because of his hair. And he certainly has a head full of it, doesn't he? Okay. Bruce and Dominic, he dates about 20 times a month, but he claims that he's never, ever been in love. And then Don, Don insists uh, our interests include jogging and rock and roll. And Don will sing on a date, too, he said. <laughs> then he drop of a coin, I'll sing. The audience vote was recorded yesterday. We're going to get to that a little bit later on, but right now Leslie's going to tell us who she chose. I chose Dominic. You chose Dominic. All right. Dominic's backstage. Let's say hello to Dominic Geronda. Hello, Dominic. Hey, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Listen, just uh, join in when you feel like it, okay? Thank you, Will. All right. Tell me about the date. We had, okay, what we did was we planned our date, but I planned the first half, which was a surprise. It was very special, and I wanted it to be a surprise. Yeah. And he planned the other half, which he had told me what it was. But I told him specifically he must be at my home at 3.40. 3.40? Well, I had my uh, chauffeur, who was my roommate, John, drop me off. Uh, I rang the bell, and the girl answered the door, and uh, I didn't know who it was. And she says, come on in. I'm uh, going to entertain you until Leslie's finished dressing. So uh, she said, sit down, make yourself comfortable, and she proceeded to uh, put on some music and taking her clothes off. What? This was your surprise? Yeah, I, I hired a stripper. You hired a stripper? I thought it... <laughs> anyway, she starts dancing around, and then all of a sudden she was on the left-hand side of him, and her tuchus was in his face. <laughs> I, mean, I was, know what it is. I mean, it's okay. if, if he got any closer, he could have taken a bite out of it. I thought he was going to. I didn't know what he was going to do. Dominic, he what, said she had what nice was, body, what's huh? going on here? Hey, uh, I thought the girl had good taste. The uh, dancer. <laughs> so on to our next destination. Well, what happened next? His chauffeur drove us to our next destination, which we pull up in front of a massage parlor. <laughs> and it's a place I go to, so it's a legitimate oh, place. It's, okay? not, it's not like... No, 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 no. It's, 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 I had worked out um, a situation with the owner that we could be massaged together because a date is together. Oh, Leslie, this is just wild. I mean, I don't, I can't, I can't fathom what this. All of a sudden, Dominic was over my table. He started massaging me. It, it was really good. Now, he massaged, as far as I was concerned, as good as the girl, and I was really comfortable. I felt really nice, and he was doing it, and he was doing it, and I was loving it. And then the next thing, all of a sudden. I felt this mouth on my neck, and it was a mmm, mmm, and I loved it. <laughs> I really enjoyed it. A stripper, a massage, what, what do you think of all this stuff? I thought I hit the jackpot, hell of a <laughs> <laughs> On to our next 
next destination. Which was? Which was their apartment to pick up the food to go on to the beach. And uh, it was set up so elaborately. It mm -hmm. was beautiful. It was a table, nice glasses, plates, uh, napkin holders, candles. Just and like then, dinner. right, and John comes out and he serves us. John, his friend. Right. I had taken my shoes off to get comfortable. Now you're through dinner. We finished dinner and we're on the way out of the park, out of parking the park. entrance. He started massaging my feet, which he's a very, he's a very good masseur. We, we've very, been very over good. That. Yeah, he's very good. But the next thing I knew, my foot was in his mouth. <laughs> maybe this is a, maybe this is a Dominic technique. I don't know, no. but then, then all of a sudden he started taking each toe individually and nibbling on it. It was hard to know whether he was trying to kiss me or not, but... Well, did you kiss or not? No. You did? No, because I was a little frightened that we had eaten garlic, and I didn't want to blow the date at that point. Man, you don't want to shoot him. You believe this? Yeah, but I wouldn't be smelling his breath. Can you believe this? That's what, she had a thing, a real hang-up about breath. And uh, she, she said that since we both ate garlic, it just wouldn't be, it was a turn-off. So that she said it would ruin our relationship, so that was it. The toes was as far as I got. I didn't want to take, I didn't want to take, I didn't want to take any chance. Okay. Tell me. Tell me how this date ended. His friend came home, and it was about 3.30, and I thought, I better start uh, ending this evening. So we went back to my place, and um, when we came into the door, the first thing, I wanted to turn him on to Maniac. I thought he'd get a real kick out of Maniac. The turtle. My turtle. I just pulled up in a limousine. I got to wave to a turtle. <laughs> he loved it. And you want to know what's worse than that? She kissed a turtle. She kissed a turtle. Well, he kissed you, but she kissed a turtle. Me, but she kissed a turtle. <laughs> I don't think turtles are really known no. for their looks anyway. <laughs> anyway, let's take a look and see the audience pick for you. Wanna? Oh, gee. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. It, it's a tie. The audience thought you should go down with either Bruce or Don. It was a tie. I don't want to go out with either one of them. And what do you want to do? I prefer to go out with Dominic. Dominic, is that all right with you? I love it. We'll I go got plans. <laughs> This date's going to be really hard to, hard to top. Are you, can you top this? Oh, yeah. Oh, you can? Yeah. <laughs> we have a nice gift for both of you. Thanks. That's the, probably the most unusual date, I think, to date, that I have ever heard. <laughs> we'll be back with another couple. Stay with us.